Hi, my name is Muhammad Syamim bin Nizamuddin, metric number D2018-2085679. Hi, my name is Muhammad Syahir bin Cik Yahya, my metric number D2018-2085696. Hello, my name is Muhammad Hazim bin Afami, metric number D2018-2085676. Uh, and my metric number is 2018-2086460. Hello, Assalamualaikum. My name is Muhammad Ali Farhan bin Muhammad. My metric number D2018-2086440. In this video, we would discuss about our foreign television channel causing harm on our culture. So, here is the list of reference for our task. You can check it out through this link if you want to have a broad explanation. So, let's watch this video. These days, the young generation is more inclined towards Western culture and they want to adopt their ideas only. Mass media such as television channels and programs have totally changed their mind of teenagers and they have just become addicted to them. They show no interest to their culture, just adopting the Western style and in this way, there is increased in gap between them and the society in which they live. The omnipresence of foreign channels and TV programs in our daily lifestyles have influenced our culture and heritage more negatively than in a positive way. Now, people want to copy their favorite stars and in the very beginning, they enter the drastic world of smoking and drinking. These foreign channels erode our national culture and instead of integrating and promoting our own culture, we are just welcoming the worst world of smoking and alcohol drinking. This underground portrait how television is possible for a new generation of smokers. The result was based on the survey that has been done. As you can see in the graph, the number of children smoking getting increased day by day and this trend was influenced mostly by the television. Foreign channels of movies have totally diverted the minds of teenagers and they start arguing with their parents to give them more and more freedom. But, my dear friends, you must note it down that more freedom means more responsibilities too and no one in this world except our parents can understand the difference between what is good or bad for us. So, what do you think about this topic? Based on the Journal of Cultural Exchange through Broadcasting in Asia, a study of Malaysian television content by Mat Sidin, Ahmad Isa and Amira Sariati Fidaus. A brief analysis of weekly television program show that the greatest percentage of program in number and airtime air over Malaysian terrestrial television are in English, followed by local Malay language programs, television program in Chinese counter, and program in other language, namely various Asian language and Spanish, make up smaller percentage of Malaysian terrestrial television content. The relative small broadcasting market in Malaysia coupled with audience segmentation are possible constraint to regional cultural exchange through broadcasting in this country. Furthermore, Malaysian media policy favors programming that serve local media player and content that encourage the information of national cultural identity, two things that foreign program are not able to do. Based on the journal of the internet internationalization of the media title does local values and cultures values undermined by Nasser Abdul Hamid state that Academy Fantasia is the first reality TV program in Malaysia which was adapted from a Mexican television program. The response by Malaysian audience, especially teenagers, is really impressive based on the pool received via SMS. This response has motivated Astro, the TV station which is responsible for adapting this program, to launch its second series of Academic Fantasia 2. 
What is more interesting is that UJ companies in Malaysia, such as Messis and Coca Cola, are willing to be co sponsors for the F2. This is due to the fact that F1 was able to prove itself as an attractive program. Next, I can see your voice Malaysia. Uh, has been confirmed for remakes in the several countries such as the United States, the United Kingdom, uh, Germany, Romania, and the Netherlands. Apart from these five latest edition international remakes of I Can See Your Voice are currently already airing in uh, seven other countries uh, like Malaysia, Bulgaria, Indonesia, China, Cambodia, Thailand, and the Philippines. In Malaysia, this program are called I Can See Your Voice Malaysia which is a long-running variety show in which celebrity guests attempt to deduce whether a participant is a talent singer, talent singer or a tone person who is an expert at lip signing by watching their performance. Okay, so uh, the media content is the responsibility for developing, for developing an audience value and norms. The influence of the media is shown is the way local people behave, such as eat and drink, and speak at their nursing style and attitude. The uh, high media penetration in Malaysia means that people are spending more time with the medium and subsequently more exposed to its content. The study by Samsung in 2000 showed that among the longest duration of media usage by Malaysian age 13 and above, uh, terrestrial TV and radio. Uh, the media being used uh, satellite TV and uh, computer software. Most of uh, the international news in Malaysia mainstream daily was from international news agencies like Reuters, Australian Press, and Associated French Press. This had a lead in Malaysian public experience the media effects the gender modern internet events. So far, this topic I think everyone has rights show their opinion. Compare for a TV channel to our TV channel, both have some good and some bad parts. It is fully dependent upon uh, to the ourselves or side. If we take if we take the bad parts of channel, so it's bad for us ourselves, or we take the parts of those uh, channel so it is good for us. And the sentence is a very TV channel only destroying our culture. It's not true. We are also destroying our culture first, so we need to think in ourselves how much we are confident to our culture and how much is that we are giving to our culture after the play. Others, and uh, last word I want to say our culture is the best culture nobody can destroy. Sometimes you through the traditional internationalization of the media. First, we can stress on the preservation of tradition uh, and values. Uh, Malaysian and NGOs uh, can play an important role to ensure that the tradition and values are maintained with the emergence of new technology. Second, we should set uh, an important law and regulations to protect our media industry. This has been done. Uh, by the government via TV programs with the rate. The government has determined that 80% TV programs must be long. This is by some state to down the uh, But the, implement the implementation needs to be strengthened to ensure that it is effectiveness. And the solution is that the Malaysian government should set aside fund of R&D at least in the local contents and problems so uh, that local can reduce the import of the programs. Further, the media industry is there has to play a role to ensure that national values and cultures are protected by open local And last but not least, parents also have to take part uh, in controlling their children. Uh, this is important so that uh, the children are only um, allowed to view suitable programs for their age. Uh, ideally, parents should be present uh, when the children watch television. So, uh, that they can uh, monitor the selection of programs and also to educate uh, them on what they did. Uh, it is not one person's job to overcome the um, trick of foreign media influence to our values and cultures. It requires everybody in the society to take part and help each other to preserve our traditions and values. As for me, uh, I would say that uh, culture depends on a person's perception. Nobody can destroy our culture without our permission, as world is becoming, becoming a global village. 
we must be ready to embrace all other cultures and have a knowledge about it. Um, by having a foreign TV channel, we get to know about the country, especially about current issues, and we also can improve our knowledge. As a student, I usually watching Discovery Channel, uh, National Geographic, BBC, and much more foreign channel uh, to expand my knowledge. And as for me, I would like to have uh, a positive pers perception and grab it as a chance for me to know other country culture. So, uh, if I travel by myself, I can avoid from BBC by other people. Uh, usually, will have more. Uh, other than that, uh, through international sport channel, we can know about the sports of other countries. Uh, as we know, uh, different countries uh, play different level of gameplay. Uh, if we look at our league gameplay, uh, I can say that uh, it is uh, as exciting as watching pin drive uh, compared to other league like England, France, German, and others. Okay. By the way, uh, with the new, with the new league technology, users can subscribe the channel as per their wish, and for parents who have children. They can lock the channels which are not suitable for children. We can blame a uh, foreign channel as some local channels are also destroying our culture. Uh, it's not their mistake because they are just following the culture. Okay, so the conclusion I think the foreign TV channels are not destroying our culture, but it improves our knowledge on the various factors. When you see the channel like uh, historical channel, discovery, BBC, and each other, uh, we can get a lot of knowledge basically on the English. We get a new knowledge from historical channel as we, we get chance to see uh, many new places, uh, especially the historical places. We later we develop our English power uh, when we hear the speaking style, uh, the pronunciation, tone, uh, and each other. And uh, also, uh, we can get a lot of uh, scientific knowledge from the foreign media channel. Okay. Uh, it is also developed our general knowledge, which we see that it has effects, but it is only on us what to see and what not to see. So, in the uh, material, uh, we should expect the right thing and we have uh, the, the, the inside. So, uh, that the you will uh, be better for us in the future. Uh, that's all for me. Uh, thank you. In conclusion, I think no one destroy your culture until you allow it. First, you need to define what is definition of culture, social behavior, food, language, is experience. Now, we are living in a global world. We should understand the demand and supply concept here. English, I think mostly spoken anywhere in this world. If you don't know India's language, why English? If anything, you got go from other culture without hesitation, accept it. Just ban their channel, not stop stopping to follow them. Even though our day to day, then we follow other people. Why? Nobody perfects in this world. So we are. Just make it high of the culture, doesn't make you cultural people. Life is short, just live, be happy, and peaceful life. According to me, every coin has both sides and has very good. We will have to take positive for it. If we don't want to destroy our culture, nobody can destroy We have to be safe. Nowadays, uh, we don't want to uh, confine ourselves in our own country for it. Uh, purpose and study purpose uh, so work is like a global, a global wish uh, every parent they have uh, desired their children will go to English mediums because of the speak English of Western culture uh, adequate uh, for example people like to watch uh, foreign channel like sports national geography uh, we get now to the information uh, this is not bad uh, but uh, somebody wants to imitate uh, bad thing is if that comes to certain life, this is bad uh, as a human. We should uh, take a good one. Uh, people want to go uh, to a prop for their work purpose. We already know the Western culture is the good for them. Nobody can destroy you if you don't want them. We are living in the 21st century. We are modern. This is the problem. As a religion, we should respect our culture. Then there, there will be no problem. Uh, in conclusion, I can look, I can conclude that every coin has two sides. We should take only positive side. We are responsible for our deeds. But of course, government is regulating the television broadcasting by allowing complaint from public and taking necessary steps, whether it is foreign or local channel. That's all for me. Thank you.